North Shore residents have something else to look out for on Kamehameha Highway. Officials say part of a road near Haula collapsed under the weight of a large truck this morning. The truck was removed. The road is back open. Bryce Moore has more. Haula residents Derek Presley came outside right after the road collapsed under the truck. He was coming off the roadway. He made a turn and as he was making his turn, his uh, truck dropped down in a crater where the road was undermined, where there's no support under the road structure. I was like, oh no, you know, deja vu, here we go. I hope no one's hurt. Speaking to the driver, Presley said he did not need medical attention. 808 hauling services was able to get the truck out on their own, and the transportation department says gravel and rock will be filled in as an immediate solution, with additional protection work later in February. Some argue those are short-term efforts, not a real fix. A real fix would be uh, something that doesn't fall apart where the Cuyahoga bags fall off into the beach, where they can be cut open by people, and where large king tide waves come in, and after three years, uh, the, the fix is completely gone. Now this incident is new, but area residents are telling me it's an example of what they've been afraid of for a long time. The highway collapsing right as cars are driving over. I'll tell you, this road is not safe right now. This road is undermined, and these cars that are actually on the water side should not be driving on this roadway. During a news conference, the Department of Transportation said a six-month project to replace the retaining bags of rocks with boulders and rubble will start this month. But finding a solution for every resident along Kamehameha Highway in order for us to make sure we can move forward on that long-term solution, we got to have that conversation of what that community is going to look like, where it's going to be, what kind of decisions we got to make as a state to ensure that we can protect everybody and service everyone while we're doing it. Um, and you're right, this is the time to, have that, to start having that conversation, that real conversation on whether or not you can stay in your home that you've been in for all your life. Bryce Moore, KHON2 News, working for Hawaii.